hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i know that you guys have not seen me in a month a month and one week but i can explain a lot of things have been happening i've been overwhelmed and youtube and uh, like i did not just have the motivation to shoot for youtube last video was like a maintenance vlog and immediately after the maintenance vlog uh, everything went downhill my mood was just horrible and i was trying to sort out my school everything about school you know i'm already done with school now so i needed to submit my my project hard copy if you're a nigerian you know what i'm talking about that hard back thing i needed to print mine do my correction submit the hard bind and yeah i know that i'm done with school finally so i just submitted that hard bind uh last week and this is july the last video i posted was in june and we're in july currently so um yeah now guess what for the entire you guys already know what i'm doing in this video I am moving back to Lagos. Oh my God! See, do you try try to be honest with the people. Try to be honest. Try to be honest. I did not plan to film this because of because my mood was still in the down area. But my friends, Sharon and people, they were like, "Oh, this is going to be like really nice content." Do you get so? <clears throat> I'm like, okay, yeah. Let me just resume here. Now I know that you go. I know I promised consistency. In fact, I was not giving consistent vibes. For like April, May, June, I was giving all of a sudden, everything just went whoop. <laughs> but I'm back. I'm better, I think. And by the grace of God, I'm going to stay good. I'm going to stay posting for you guys. And you know the drill. And this is like a vlog showing you guys everything I'm going to be doing to get back to Lagos. So this is, I won't say this is the last time you guys will see this room. This is our kitchen. This is my kitchen window and the lighting. It won't be the last time because I'm going to come back for clearance in November. But yeah, so let's just get right into uh, organizing everything. Mind you, they're already organized. I have eight bags, bro. I have eight bags and boxes. And that's not all of my stuff. I still have like my books and my rack and some other things. I'm not using flights, by the way, so they will not charge me a head and lion's tail or lion's head and lion's tail. I'm going to use like a bus, but I'm thinking of wibbling my wibbling some of my things to Lagos so that I don't have to carry too much load when I'm actually traveling. I'm going back on Sunday. So I know I've said so much already. There's a lot to take in. It's cause I have been MIA. But I will put that yeah. in my business. Um, um Philippa has been staying in my room since she packed all her things from my room. Philippa has already transported all her things home. Now Sharon, on the other hand. Sharon, <laughs> Sharon is happy that I'm going so that she'll have the whole room to herself. So, yeah, but her, she'll soon go to Sha. back to lagos these are most of my stuff actually i already threw out some things a few things and i have my rack still here Sha. i try to just arrange everything like this so that when i get home and i'm unpacking it wouldn't be so difficult for me so yeah i'm going to have to rebuild like four or five of the boxes today so that when i'm traveling i'll just carry like maybe two hand luggages and we'll get it moving we're going to try to keep this moving train moving till like december no stops all gas no brakes you feel me <laughs> yeah you guys are going to miss each other princess already left last week by the way you guys know princess she already left last week so but you know the thing eh? we all stay in lagos now so eh, i mean philippa is trying to move to lagos so all of us will still be together technically and we are going to come back we're all going to come back in november for november. our convocation and to start clearance so we're coming back in the next three three months yes yeah i feel very nostalgic packing up my stuff actually i feel very because i remember when i came to oka like for the first, first time i came to oka i was i was 17 years old i was 17 when my dad dropped me in in my first hostel i wasn't doing youtube at the time and i actually remember when i moved to this lodge that was in 2020 so like bro it's crazy and i feel like moving back to lagos now is a huge it's a it's in fact it's a huge change because the most i've been in lagos is maybe two months three months six months but 
I've not really stayed there as somewhere that I'm based because like since I, since I started schooling in Oka now this has been like my primary city because of school but now that I'm done I'm moving back to my dad's house I am I'm happy I'm done with school but at the same time I'm going to miss the environment I'm going to miss the spotlight I'm going to miss the environment I'm going to miss the calm in Oka I'm going to miss everything and I think I'm going to do a video a separate video saying the things I'm actually going to miss about Oka I think that's what I'm I'm going to do that one after I drop the song because right now I don't have time so I'm doing a lot of a lot of moving around you feel me so yeah I'm just really excited I hope you guys are going to enjoy that video the one I have planned the things I already made a list things I'm going to miss when I leave Oka it should be something that I would have posted before I actually leave Oka but whatever the case you guys understand my plight right Guys, I'm on the, I stay on the last floor, so I don't know how I'm going to carry all these things downstairs. I'm about to go and rebuild them now. Guy, guy, this is insane. I don't know how I'm going to carry them downstairs, but the Lord is my muscles. Hi guys, good morning. Um, so I already sent out my boxes, like the way bill. So this morning I'm going to go and take out these nails. I've had them on for a week. Wait, it's not even morning though. I'm checking. I don't I think on my clock. This is like afternoon. This this was this is 2 p.m. Okay, so I am going to go and take out my take out these nails and get something right done and then I'll go and get waxed. Cause you guys already know how Lagos prices are now. Let me just save money for this month. And do something cheaper here in Oka before I go back to Lagos and start doing all these things again. So yeah, like I said, I'm traveling on Sunday, as you already know. Now I just want to go and get all of these things done. Then I will go back home, and yeah. I'm so tired and exhausted. <sighs> okay, hi guys. It's day one being back in Lagos, and this is currently what my room looks like. Mm. This is what it looks like. It's really, you know, I don't know when they were painting, I don't know who said they should use blue and orange, but I am, I am, uh. I want to change the whole look of the room. I want to, you know, um, get a vanity table, uh, paint the room white, because white usually gives any good space the that luxury look. Do you feel me? So that's what I'm going for. Uh, I should say the budget I have for this room, but I will get money, get budgets. So I'm just going to be doing my thing slowly. So this video, I don't know when I'll drop it, but I'll be fixing up the room very slowly because I don't have a lot of money to just throw into it at once. So I'll be doing all of that. I mean, I'd like to do that, but as I don't have money, it's going to be small, small. So yeah, I was saying I'll change the curtains, but I don't see a need because this one still look pretty. But anyway, it depends on what it looks like when I've painted the room, Shah. So yeah, painting, vanity table, um, some floating shelves, uh, some a new mirror maybe, bulbs, new bulbs, and then um, LED lights basically. So that's all I have in mind. 
for now uh you know i'll just keep you guys posted with everything going on and i have to paint the room before i organize my stuff my all everything i came back from school is i still like on the floor in the dressing room it's a lot but i cannot unpack right now until i paint so because if i unpack now when it's time to paint i'll have to pack up everything again so there's no need so let's see let's see let's see 